Okay guys, this is the tutorial on how to use your aid calendar. So, I want everybody to be able to use this efficiently so we can actually have, you know, some raids going on. We know what we've got, who we've got, where we're going. Raid leaders, I want you to actually uh, stay in after the video. There'll be a little segment for you to teach you your stuff. After the initial stuff is done, everyone go do your own thing. Okay, first off, you need to have a website uh, or a website account because as you can see if you don't where's the uh, raid sign up so uh, it's required so go ahead and make one anyway okay now there's raid sign up under this you can see it's only viewable to members hit raid sign up now because this is set up on a different database that means you're gonna have to create another account you can still use your same account name but uh you're still going to have to um, create a new username here. Now, this isn't going to work in Internet Explorer 7, so you either have to go get Internet Explorer 9, or you're going to have to go to Firefox.com, and you're going to have to uh, wait for it to load. It should take you five seconds. Click this, you download it, go through all that jazz, take you five seconds. Now you're going to have to register. For the sake of registering, I'm calling this account test. Then I'm going to give me a password, give me a confirm, and then an email. Feel free to spam it. It's a spam one anyway. So uh, go ahead and submit. You have successfully registered. Uh, now go ahead and log in. I'm going to have to uh, use this. I'll use test instead of mine. Uh, hit submit. Now here. Here's your aid calendar. First, you're going to have to make a character. You'll get these options. Go ahead and create one. So, we're making Mr. Test. That's my character name. I'm going to choose your race, choose whatever. Guild is Brutality, because if you're not in Brutality and you're seeing this, there is seriously something wrong. Keep your level as 80, you know, just, uh, just for the sake of having the raid calendar work. Then hit Submit. Now you've got a working character. So, you're going to hit home. Let's say uh, you want to do the Kaliki's raid. And uh, your melee DPS. You're going to be in queue. You're going to hit submit. Now, come here. Let's say you're going to be 20 minutes late for this raid. You're going to go ahead and choose the right raid that you're queued for. And see here, you'll type, you'll click NA and say, uh, let's say you're going to be 20 minutes late. 20 minutes late due to work. Then hit submit. We'll know why you're 20 minutes late and uh, we'll keep a slot open for you. So uh, now let's say you can't come to a raid. Let's say uh, this raid. Uh, it's set up for uh, gem cutting and XP. So let's say you're level 80 and you're not a gem cutter and you really don't feel like coming. You're gonna go to you're gonna go to this raid and you're gonna hit here. You're gonna go ahead and select not available. Now in here, you're gonna select not available and uh, hit NA. Just give us a reason. Anything's acceptable. Uh, level 80, not gem cutter. Busy. Now for raids, we want an actual excuse. Level 80 is an excuse to come. But, uh, so, that's basically your segment. <coughs> now, raid leaders, please stay tuned after this, because you're gonna, we're gonna go into the more advanced stuff. And as far as everybody else go goes, this is courtesy of Ramiko and Sarek for your raid calendar. Now, raid leaders, gonna get a couple options here. Gonna go ahead and log in on Ramiko. Raid leaders. Here's how you create, let's say you wanted to create a raid. You're going to have to come here, create raid. Uh, here are going to be the pre-select ones. I haven't made them all yet because yes, I am lazy. I do have a life, either though I stayed up all night trying to get this to work. Let's say location. Let's say you're going to make a PVP one. Name it Kashada. Uh, Kashada PVP. Give it a date. Let's say it's uh, tomorrow. It's the 12th, I think. Yeah, 
tomorrow's the 12th. This is always going to be Eastern Standard Time, and you can also hit this and go ahead and hit 12. That'll work too. Uh, this is always going to be Eastern Standard Time. Let's uh, say about 7 o'clock is going to be your initial start, and then you're going to start PvPing at the 30. This is when you start inviting. This is when you start. Freeze time, keep it 0, zero. Uh, Description. We're going to screw up blood. Don't want to use curse words in case someone's not supposed to be here. Now, that's a tier 2 raid, tier 2 raid, tier 2 raid. Calixes, Anixia, PvE, PvP. Those shouldn't be their Vistrix and Yakmar. This is PvP. Minimum level, yeah, you can app a 70. They'll be fine. Maximum level, of course, is 80. Raider limit is going to be 24 for raids, 48 for um, battle keeps. And for here, let's say uh, you want at least four, at least four healers. I'm gonna put two tank, uh, six. You know, this can just be an off number. No one cares. And you're gonna hit submit. Here's your rate. Now. Let's say you screwed up big time because you didn't do this. You're going to come here and you're going to hit edit. Um, let's say you didn't want four healers. Let's say you wanted six healers. Just click that. Click uh, this again, that again, that again, and click that just to make sure it all stays. And uh, go ahead and hit submit. Now, raid leaders, you're required to have Firefox, or you're not going to be able to enter description. Now, raid leaders, let's say here's the Kaliki's event. Now, let's say uh, Mr. Test, you want, or no, let's say Sarek. You want Sarek in that Kaliki's too. He, you've went to Sarek, you've said, yo, are you going to be available for this raid? And he has said, I am going to be to this raid. I am going to be on time. Then you're going to go ahead and click make available. And Sarek will come up here. I'm going to make him unavailable again. Or put him back in queue because we actually haven't asked him. Either though, so far he's been with all the raids we've been at. So, that's basically your tutorial. Now, raid leaders... Because you are the raid leader and you're probably an officer, remember, encourage your guild. You want them on this calendar. You're the raid leader. You want to raid. So encourage everybody to use the calendar. Let's get raiding. This basically wraps it up. Again, courtesy of Remico for tutorial, courtesy of Remico and Sarek for the nice, beautiful calendar. Thank you and have a nice day.